Hello guys, uh, let's continue uh, the lecture series on database management systems. Uh, we have uh, covered the uh, concepts of primary key, foreign key and candidate key and super keys. Along with that we have also known that how uh, attribute closer can be find out. Now let's start with the question. If a relation is given like R uh, with attributes A b c d and e and the set of functional dependencies given in, for this relation is a drives d a b drives c b drives e d drives c and uh, e drives a so this is the functional dependency set now question is what are the candidate keys of one of the decomposed relation R1 with attributes A, B, C. Okay. Now so i think you have uh, you can see that the question which is to be asked is about the decomposition so if i divide this relation into two parts then what would be the candidate key for one of the part which is divided so how to solve this type of questions so by this question uh, we can uh, we can uh, in for that this uh, a b c d e is divided into maybe various parts and one of the part is r1 this is r okay so in order to find out the candidate key for this r1 set i need to find out the uh, functional dependencies for the decomposed relation what would be the functional dependencies which are specific to this relation r1 so how we can find it find it out uh, we just check the closures of this uh, given functional dependent set so the a closer so suppose this is r1 uh, functional dependencies i just write it here uh, temporarily now uh, i find out the closer of a so a closer would be a a drives t t drives c okay then find out b closer b closer would be b e e drives a a b drives c and uh, c um, b drives e it is already there so yeah that's it i think E drives A, yeah, it is already covered. A drives T, yes, A drives T, and D drives C is already covered. I think that is fine. A, B, C, D, E, all are covered. Now C plus is derived only C, and uh, A B plus derives A B. Mm, A B drives C, C drives T. So A drives T, A B C D E. Okay. Now similarly, B C closer is also drives A B C D and E, and A C closer is drives A D C. So I write down the all the combination of attributes and find out their closers. Okay. So in this, uh, by this I can say that. So this is D. I can say that this a b is can be uh, uh, this is a super key because b closer uh, individually determined so b is a candidate key for this relation while a b uh, b c uh, is are the super keys okay so now we are not interested in uh, finding out finding out the super key or candidate key for the relation r but we are interested in finding out first the functional dependencies which are specific for a relation R1 which is decomposed from R 
and the attributes which comes under R1 is A, B, C. So uh, by the closer, I just find a set of functional dependencies which is specific to R1. By this set, I can say that because I have A, B, C attributes and at I'll, I'll, at LHS side I have A attribute in RHS we have C attributes from R1 so I can refer that A can drive C from the second set I can refer B can drive uh, uh, this uh, A and C both attribute by third uh, I cannot refer uh, because C drives only itself so it is not so much useful now in uh, fourth one a b can drive c yes b c can drive a yes i just need to find out the trivial non-trivial functional dependencies so uh, these are all are the non-trivial functional dependencies of r1 so these are the non-trivial functional dependencies on r1 okay once i find out the non trivial functional dependencies i can easily find out the uh, candidate key so like here b closer would be the candidate key because it can uniquely determine each of the attribute given in r1 so b is the candidate key so this is answer for the question now if the decomposed relation or uh, second decomposed relation on the same relation r uh, would given as uh, suppose decomposed relation R2 is given as C, D and E then what would be the candidate key for this one so let's find out the set because uh, functional dependency set so the processor is same for R2 we need to calculate the functional dependency set so the functional dependency set uh, includes we have C, D and E we check the uh, functional dependencies here uh, you can see that a closer and b closer there is no uh, requirement for this one i require c d e and the lhs side of the functional dependency set so i just directly uh, go to the the c or d closer so yeah you can also find out the d closer which is given as d and c so uh, from this relation i can uh, infer that uh, uh, as as you can see c closer uh, give only c d closer gives d and c and e e closer will give uh, e a a will give b and uh, d will give c and uh, uh, c uh, yeah that's it and uh, we can also say that uh, yeah EADC is a fine okay fine. now we can we can also uh, make the combination like we have done in the previous example we can also make the combination of C and D so CD closer may be a one combination which refers only CD also we can make a combination of CE closer so CE closer would be A, D, C and E okay now we can also make a combination of D and E which will give you D, E, C, A attributes okay now so these are the uh, main combination by three attributes C, D and E based on the given functional dependency now we can uh, infer the uh, functional dependence set for this decomposed relation and that set would lead to D tends to C yes it is there by this functional dependency we can also find the relation of e which will which can drive uh, e can drive c and d okay and uh, also uh, similarly uh, uh, you can derive e with the combination of c or ce by by this Function dependencies E C can drive D, and uh, yeah, that's it. So in this one, you can you can easily find out the candidate key that E closer can derive all the attributes C D and E. So E closer would be the candidate key for this set.
okay so if, if a relation is given and this is decomposed into two parts r1 and r2 you can easily find out the candidate key for the decomposed relation also by deriving first the set of functional dependencies and for those set of functional dependencies you can determine the candidate key thank you very much